I just discovered a super filthy altar tactic being deployed to make massive gains in server 8 of Viking Rise. Our server has been up and running for just over a week and our tribe who call themselves the House of Nutters have been top of the leaderboard pretty much the entire time. If we take a look at the tribe, sure they've got some whales. Clearly they're just pay to wins I hear you thinking. Don't get me wrong, some serious cash has been spent on some of these accounts to gain this quickly. But that's not the only reason Honor dominating. If you've played any massively multiplayer online real-time strategy games, such a mouthful, Rise of Empires, Ice and Fire for example, then there's a lot of similar gameplay and you'll have no doubt seen tactics like running a university before. If you haven't, Future Archie will make a bunch of videos and link them on the screen or in the bio somewhere. But that's not what I want to talk about today, Gary. I want to discuss this dirty dirty little tactic that I mentioned earlier. Meet Zero and Yaya Pauline. I wonder if he's related to Yaya Tore. Yaya, Yaya, Yaya. Now there might be more of these sneaky snakes, but these are the ones I've spotted today. So how have these players taken down over 40 altars? Somebody play some Snoop Dio Double G, cause we got ourselves some pimps in the house. I say pimping. No sexual favours have been paid for that I know of. They have, however, been selling themselves out as super helpful ultra-assisting mercenaries who just want to see the server do well and be peacefully friendly with everyone. I have all the evidence to say this is not true. Now let's talk about the whys and the hows. How are they doing this? Your super friendly neighbourhood nutters are joining smaller tribes and offering their assistance at just the right time. They are undoubtedly scouring the server map for tribes whose territories have just reached their altars and are yet to take them. If we take a quick look, here is a prime example. Neo, otherwise known as Neo Paragon, which is a pretty cool name to be fair. I'm a big Matrix fan. Morpheus for PM. Oh look, perfect. Neo have three spaces available. So off our little nutters trot into their tribe, who are super grateful and will immediately accept that kind of power applying to join. Hey, they say. Would you like some help with your altar? Sneaky sneaky. So now they've infiltrated the smaller tribe, they can use their territory relocators and join the rally at the altar. Of course, the tribe members, just like mine, are like, yeah, awesome, thank you, you're such good guys. At the end of the day, they want the rewards too. And this is where we reach the why. If we take a look back at the altar Neo are on the edge of taking, you will see that all the members of the first tribe to defeat the altar will receive these tasty as fudge rewards. 1000 gems, 1 territory relocator, 3 hours of speed ups, 500k food and lumber, and 375,000 stone. Somebody grab me a bat and a blindfold, cause I'm gonna smash the goodies out of this pinata. Now imagine how fast members of your tribe could grow if in the first week they just smashed altar after altar after altar to the extent of over 40 times in a single server. And because they kindly offered their assistance, as far as the game is concerned, they are in the tribe as it took the altar. The best part is they get a free shot at doing it again because they get a gosh dang nabbit territory relocator as a gift. So next time a suspiciously helpful goat arrives at your door, say no, we're good thanks. Our tribe has got this. What do you think? Would you have let them help? I'd like to hear your thoughts in the comments or you can jump over to the Viking Half Discord community and have a little chat about it there. I'll drop a link in the bio one or in the comments or something. If you've made it this far, then I hope you've enjoyed the video. And if you want to see some more Viking Rise tactics exposed or follow along with some of my gameplay guides, hints and tips, then drop us a like and a subscribe. I'd really appreciate your support. Stay safe, sons of Ragnar.